We have just sung about God's love being the best love. And one of the ways he shows that is his consistent grace and forgiveness towards us, his sinful people. Our love towards him is anything but the best. Our love for him is often cold, disobedient, idolatrous, as our hearts love other things more than him. So each week it's important for us as a church to acknowledge, as the great hymn says, Our sins they are many, his mercy is more. As we confess, he forgives, because Jesus has taken the punishment our sins deserve when he died on the cross. Let me remind us of our God's great character as I read these words from Exodus 34, 6. And if you would like to confess your sins, join in with the words that will come on the next slide. God said to Moses, I am the Lord, the compassionate and gracious God, slow to anger, full of love and faithfulness, maintaining love to thousands and forgiving wickedness, rebellion and sin. So let us confess our sins to our compassionate and forgiving God. We say together, Almighty God, our Heavenly Father, we have not loved you as we should, or one another as ourselves. We have chosen our own way and ignored you. But merciful and gracious God, the Saviour of all who trust you, Please forgive us and make us more like Jesus. For his sake, turn our hearts to love all that is good and true, so that we may live to please you. And we ask these things for your honour and glory. Amen. Next, we're going to join in saying the Lord's Prayer together. We say, Our Father in heaven, May your name be honoured, may your kingdom come, and your will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us today the things we need, and forgive us our sins, as we forgive those who sin against us. Let us not give in to temptation, and protect us from evil, for the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours now and forever. Amen. Well, next in our service, we have the lockdown link up. And after that, we're going to sing, Who Are We?